Hello. I hope everyone has been practicing the jab and cross with the gloves and mitts, both throwing the punches and holding the punches because holding is an art in and of itself. So you need to practice both sides. The third basic punch is called the hook. And whereas the jab and the cross, if you want to look at them as pushes, you would look at the hook as a pull. So to develop the mechanics for the hook, we're going to do a little drill right now. Uh, both Kevin and I are left foot forward, and we're going to hook the inside of our left wrists against each other. If, it's, if I'm going first, I'm going to picture that I just threw my cross. All my weight is on my left leg and my right heel is in the air. He's just the opposite. All of his weight is on his right leg and his left heel is in the air. And all I'm going to do is shift my weight from my left leg to my right leg as I turn and pull against him with my left wrist. As he shifts his weight to his left leg, his right heel comes up. Now it's his turn. He shifts and pulls. I shift and pull. So the arms do not move. The only thing that happens is we shift the weight from one side to the other, letting the hips generate the motion. Once you've practiced that, now we'll go ahead and try it with the gloves and mitts. If you recall, if Kevin is holding for the jab and the cross, he points the mitts at me, each mitt in front of a shoulder. But because the hook is a pull, instead of pointing the mitt at me, he actually turns it around and points it at himself. Just like the jab and the cross, he doesn't want to eat the shot. So as I throw my hook, he pulls and throws a little hook of his own. Because if you don't pull a little bit, you're going to feel it in the shoulder and the elbow. Because the hook is the first technique where a lot of people start to feel just how much torque there is in the hips. So go slow on this one. Gradually pick up the speed and the power. But to practice the hook, all of my weight is on my left leg. Again, I'm picturing that I just threw the cross. All the weight is on my left leg. My right heel is in the air. All I'm gonna do is raise my elbow. You can go vertical or turn it over. That's gonna be a personal preference raise the elbow and all I do is shift my weight from my left leg to my right. Be heavy, keep the shoulders off, let your hips generate the motion. Practice that, see how it goes.